and welcome to another purveyor of light, Lightroom quick tip. Uh, today we've got an actually very common uh, answered question, uh, but it's one when once we've used Lightroom for so many years, we find out all the mistakes we made, especially when it comes to the catalog. Uh, we all start out, we install Lightroom, and we accept the defaults and the catalog, where it is, and where our pictures are housed. And then as years go by, we find out that, hey, wow, we, we really did it wrong. We, we shouldn't be putting all our pictures on the internal hard drive of our computer. Uh, you're inevitably going to run out of space. Uh, things are going to get messy. And so inevitably, we all evolve to the fact where we're going to buy an external hard drive and we're just going to make one hard drive for all our pictures and make everything nice and neat again. Uh, and so I'm going to show you three easy steps to accomplish moving your Lightroom photos over to an external hard drive. It's literally three easy steps. If you follow me along, it'll be seamless. There'll be no issues. Nothing will get lost. And everything will be hunky-dory. So let's go ahead and jump in and show you how easy it is. All right. So first thing we got to do is we've got to, of course, plug in your hard drive. So take your external hard drive and plug it in, okay? And I've done just that for simple things. I put it here, okay? I put it a, an external hard drive in, and we're going to uh, use this drive for Lightroom, all my photos, okay? All right, so that's step one. All right, so step two. Okay, step two is going to be telling Lightroom about this hard drive. All right, and that gets people right off the bat with the problem. So if I go into Lightroom and I go over here to my catalog and my drive, my folders, I see there's my main hard drive internal. I see my pictures folder because I got my pictures in here, right? So, but I got a problem. My external hard drive is not showing up. And that's because Lightroom doesn't know anything about it. So we need to tell Lightroom, hey, we have an external hard drive that we're going to use for Lightroom pictures. So we get a little plus thing here right on the folders. Just click, click and we're going to add a folder. Okay. So we're going to add a folder. And then it's going to say, what are you going to hold? Wow, what, where? You just slide down, find that external hard drive that you plugged in. Okay. And in my case, it was the Samsung, and I'm going to put a new folder in there. Uh, so I'll click new folder, and I'm going to give this folder, this is the folder where I'm going to house all my photos in. Okay, so you can name it anything you wish. Uh, I'm just going to call it my pictures stuff. How's that? So that's original. All right, so I hit OK, create. It's going to create that folder, and now we're going to choose this folder. And now you'll notice on the left, we now have the Samsung drive showing up. And with the arrow, we open it up, and we can see my picture stuff. But there's zero pictures in it. Okay? Believe it or not, that was step two. And so now all we have to do is step three. Okay? Step three is to go to our original hard drive, right, where our pictures are. Okay? And now just simply click and drag onto the picture stuff. Now Lightroom's going to say, you're going to about to move all your files from this folder to this folder. And it can't be undone. Okay. So just make sure you drag it properly. And if you did, you just hit move. Okay. Now, uh, once you're doing this, depending on how many pictures you have in your library existing, may take five minutes, may take 10, it may take six hours, depends on how big your library is, okay? Either way, go have a cup of coffee, come back and check on it, and, and up to ten. when it's done, you're done. You have successfully migrated all your Lightroom pictures over to an external hard drive, and everything will be there, nothing will be missing, and uh, everything will be perfect. All right, I told you it was easy, guys. All right, so till next week, you guys take care.